यू ऑल ऑन पी डब्ल्यू गेट वाला चैनल वी आर प्रोवाइडिंग यू ऑल इन साइट आफ्टर द गेट एग्जामिनेशन फॉर हाउ टू अप्लाई फॉर योर एम टेक एडमिशन एंड मेनी अदर थिंग्स टूडे आई हैव ब्रॉट हियर फॉर यू गाइज द सेशन अबाउट वॉट इज द गेट स्कोर एंड बेस्ट पॉसिबल गेट स्कोर फॉर योर आई आई टी आई आई सी एंड एन आई टी प्लेसमेंट फॉर कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड डी ए प्रोसेस सो एज यू ऑल नो दैट वी हैव टू मोर चैनल वेयर वी प्रोजेक्ट अ लॉट ऑफ सच कैंड ऑफ वीडियोज वन इज गेट वाला अनादर वन इज गेट वाला सी एस ई सी आई एन वेयर वेयर वी पोस्ट लॉट ऑफ वीडियोज इन हिंदी लैंग्वेज सो यू can follow at least the content of that those channels also apart from that for the language barriers whatever you are having we are having and conducting lot of post gate guidance session here also so that you guys can get more insights okay before i go ahead i will have to talk about a few things why the scores and cutoffs see why we talk about scores and cutoffs just because you must have an idea what two types of students can watch this sessions or will be watching this session first those who have already written gate exam and through this year 2025 or 2024 or maybe 2023 gate examination whatever score they have they want to take admission second those students who are willing to write gate examination in 26 or 27 and they want to know exactly the admission process beforehand or they want to know how much cut off we will have to make so that we can reach to our dream college iit isc or whatever so very simple if you are into that domain where you want to take admission what i want to tell you is just shortlist your college first list of colleges shortlist list of colleges whatever the colleges you can apply for how you will do that why this is very very important just because students are not aware of the admission process and that is why we are here to tell you guys so what exactly you need to do is whatever your score you have you are having current score whichever score you have plus 100 minus 100 you just do that score plus 100 minus 100 there is a range of 200 okay i'll tell you let's say your score is 700 so between 600 to 800 whatever the colleges are there whose cut off is in between this range 600 to 800 based on your category of course you will have your that particular college in your target list so shortlist those colleges to apply and then after that what you need to do is you need to just go for the admission process admission process oops you need to just understand what is the admission process so explore admission process of those colleges see most of the colleges will have direct admission through your gate but some of the colleges are having interviews like mtech in ai in iisc bangalore mtech in computation and data science in iisc bangalore mtech in quantum technology in iisc bangalore are having 30% weightage for written test or interview or both depends on the different you know course work etc so explore the admission process if needed then prepare for admission process maybe written test or interview or something and whenever the last date comes you need to apply keep applying for those colleges you can make that list even more shorter if you have that idea that okay among these six seven colleges where i am applying i can get one or two easily whatever i am trying to so if you are sure enough based on your score and maybe some someone else like you know someone is giving you guidance or something based on that so you can decide exactly that okay with that score you can get these colleges so you can even shortlist more apart from that if your score is 600 or above if your score in computer science and da let's say 550 and above even 550 i am talking about general okay you can make adjusted the uh, you know uh, those kind of uh, 
uh, scores based on your category so for general 550 and above if your score is and if you are not getting any good college which you want to target you can go for mtech research mtech research are courses where you have more research work lesser coursework but for that we have made a lot of videos how to prepare for it and many such kind of things we have already covered so you can go ahead with that mtech research having great opportunity to learn from top colleges same placement same iit tag same kind of people who will be around you so everything is almost same only thing is with less score how you get admission is through one interview and that interview will be around your gate score and gate knowledge only so you'll have to just prepare for that that's it so if you are thinking like okay my knowledge is good gate exam went not well enough not appropriately well enough go for mtech research if your score is good and of course iit is iit no matter what iit if you get top college with lesser score you will never ever regret i'm telling you so this is what you're gonna do now coap registration portal is there that particular common offer acceptance portal is that there that particular portal is for what see what happens all the colleges are having their own admission process and portals so what you need to do is let's say you are applying for top four colleges let's say iic bangalore iit bombay iit madras and iit Dehl delhi so among those you will have to give preference that which college you will take admission first if you will get all four which one you will prefer first preference second preference third preference four preference like this you will have to add and all four colleges if you are if you are getting then only one you will select which one you will select for such preferencing setting preferences setting and selecting only one and rejecting three there should be a common portal and common portal is coap so how does it work you will apply on the admission process or portal of each and every individual college but before that you will have to make a profile on coap counseling portal so when you make a profile on coap portal you get a registration number that registration number you fill in all the iits portal so that what happens all the iits whoever are giving their admission to you a seat to you all the seats will be visible in the coap portal that these colleges have given an offer to you you can select one and reject all let's say you are not getting your preferred college then you can say i am rejecting right now all or maybe i am selecting this for the temporary basis but if next round i will be getting better opportunity i'll take that like this coap portal works so coap you can apply for so that all the top colleges or all the iits will be participating into that and these are coap dates 27 march already coap registration started seat one allotment will start from 17th may before that all the iits will close their admission portal for once and all and apart from that if any iit is having mtech research or any other mtech admission process like written test or interview or whatever like iic bangalore is having for mtech ai cds and quantum so all those also will be done so that you will be only left with the counseling round one two three four five and then after that additional rounds are there till july okay so already i have explained you how does it work now look at this these are the cutoff of the different different courses da electronics computer science and so on this year cs cutoff was 29.2 normalized marks and for da it was 29 just because paper was little difficult this time for da if you talk about cutoff see qualifying cutoff of the college is published or the gate exam is published by gate exam organizing college and this is based on how many number of students are scoring what marks etc etc but let's talk about admission cutoff admission cutoff means admission cutoff is that cutoff that is the lowest score out of thousand where the admission has been happened yes my dear friend exactly let's say 500 
uh, let's say 50 students IIC Bangalore has taken. So different different 50 students will have different different score. What is the least minimum score on which IIC Bangalore has taken admission this year up after all the rounds that will be the cutoff score below that there was no any admission taken for that year. So look at this if you talk about top IIT colleges highest and lowest gate score 2024 admission then look at this highest IIT Madras was having 845 computer science it is and 498 for ST lowest score for ST was 498 IIT Madras has taken similarly for DA DS and AI highest was for general 813 and 551 for ST Similarly, for IIT Delhi, Bombay, Kanpur, Khadakpur and all other cutoffs are over here present for you guys. For different different colleges, you can see, of course, for general, what is the minimum cutoff? This is the minimum cutoff. Minimum cutoff means minimum. B above that, all the scores were accepted. If anybody was having 858, 68, 70, all those were accepted. This was the minimum. Similarly, MTech MDS program for IIC Bangalore. Look at that. Here we have artificial intelligence, CS, MTech AI, CS, MTech CDS. Cutoffs are different, different. You can see over here general OBC, SC, ST, EWS, and all other category cutoffs are present over here. This is Next, look at this earth sciences, instrumentation, mobility, quantum technology, quantum technology. I was talking about, right? You can go ahead with it. If you get an opportunity to have an interview with quantum technology, go for it and take it just because Google, Facebook are investing a lot of lot of money in quantum computing. So if such kind of companies are investing billions and millions of money in that kind of technology. Of course, it is emerging technology and in near future, you'll be having lot of jobs around it. IIC Bangalore's different different cutoffs for smart manufacturing, signal processing, robotics, etc. are over here. Now, let's talk about NIT cutoff. Okay, a lot of students are posting some okay, scores, etc. etc. Kya milega and all. I'll, I'll talk about it. Just wait for some time. I'll talk about it. So, NIT Trichy, look at this. NIT Trichy for different categories. Highest 804 was general category, lowest 650 for general category. So, this is my lowest cutoff. NIT Suratkal was 675. NIT Warangal 690. Three. Similarly, NIT Silchar, you can go for 448 also, NIT Durgapur 505. For DA, 442 and 547 for general category. For NIT Daily, of course, highest is high, but lowest is too low. NIT Calicut 599. So if you have, of course, you know, uh, 600 plus these NITs and you know, second generation IITs you may get. But apart from that, I'll tell you one thing. You should definitely try for MTech research in top colleges. If your score is very low that you can't get a good college, then of course, PGW, which is uh, IIIT Hyderabad, then Bits Pilani, IIIT Delhi, MIT Manipal, and similar kind of so many colleges are there which are conducting their own examination. You can go ahead with that. Okay, uh, Shubham Kumar says 317 rank 807 score OBC IIC Bangalore may possible hey if yes which COAP round uh, it is very difficult Shubham 317 you can try but you should apply for at least three more colleges IIT Bombay Madras and Delhi also. Uh, difficult last year's cut of 317 rank is very difficult as I am expecting 250 to 300 rank you can get if many students from OBC category are going towards IIT Bombay then you may stand a chance or many students are going towards IIT Madras or MTech AI such kind of a courses then you may stand a chance so you may wait after two rounds we will come live and talk about that particular thing that if you may get IIC Bangalore next round or not. 334 OBC CS paper, any new NIT or NIT possible, very difficult, but 334 is very, very low. NITs you can get, Northeast wala NITs and all.
343 ECE कैटेगरी OBC BHU मिल जाएगा 340 थी रैंक और स्कोर इट इज इज इट अ रैंक और स्कोर अजिंक से 664 इन CSE OBC कैन आई गेट IIT अजिंक क्या यू कैन गेट IIT बट यू विल नॉट गेट टॉप IIT डायरेक्ट एडमिशन इट इज वेरी डिफिकल्ट रादर यू कैन ट्राई फॉर एम टेक रिसर्च इन टॉप आई वॉज सब्जेक्ट टू प्रिपेयर फॉर आई एस सी स्मार्ट मोबिलिटी एंड लॉजिस्टिक सिस्टम इंटरव्यू स्मार्ट मोबिलिटी इज ऑल अबाउट मैकेनिकल प्लस कंप्यूटर साइंस का कोलाबोरेशन सो इफ यू आर अ सी एस स्टूडेंट एंड अप्लाइंग फॉर इट यू शुड गो अहेड विद द नॉलेज ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स मोर एंड प्रोग्रामिंग इन डी एस ए एटलीस्ट नॉर्थ ईस्ट एंड आई टी कॉलेज इज वर्थ डूइंग एमटेक See, definitely not so worth for those who can spare one more year and do their rank better in next year. But for those who have already had drop or they don't want another drop and they just want a college for doing M Tech so that their you know uh, career can go ahead well, then fine enough. Apart from that, there are certain college exams like uh, PG SET exam is there for Karnataka. where you can get admission into top colleges of karnataka like uh, rvc rv kerala college of engineering in bangalore so you can try those also jadavpur university is there then pune you know uh, engineering college is there such kind of colleges you may opt where placements can be better so this this kind of approach you guys can prefer okay thank you so much everybody apart from that once again i'm telling you you just follow one telegram channel which is v i s h v a d w e p s i r this is the telegram group id vishwadeep sir okay uh, difficult here to understand i'll write here vishwadeep sir if you will follow this particular telegram channel over here i have dropped for computer science and da all approximately 60 70 college cut off yes for all the categories more than 65 colleges cut off i have i have posted here in a pdf format you just follow that particular group over group just check out the pinned messages for da also and for cs also a great great you know a uh, college cut off list is available over there and you guys can just follow that pdf to shortlist your colleges and you can understand where you can get admission this year based on those cut off thank you so much once again have a great day happy learning bye bye